Good morning. I am making a video here for anyone out there who just could use some guidance in coming into the moment, uh, really coming into meditation or what I call shine time, which is connecting and rooting down, getting grounded um, into this moment, into your body, into your breath. It's very simple practice and doing this several times a day is what will lead you to really remembering who you truly are and being able to walk in the world from a place of peace and centeredness regardless of what's going on around you, which is the ultimate, right? Before each private session or class that I offer, I always use this process and my clients and community are just like, can you please make a video on this? So I'm gonna share this with everyone here, um, just so you can return to this anytime you need to like drop in to yourself. Just taking a deep inhalation in and on the exhale closing your eyes and if there's anything in your hands any worries about the future any other programs open on your computer just really closing all that down and coming into this moment giving yourself full presence giving yourself your full friendship as you would the most glorious lover treat yourself with that same reverence with a willingness to open your breath open your awareness open yourself to yourself and the easiest way to do that is you start breathing into the belly and ideally exhaling out through the mouth so again inhaling in through the nose if possible and exhaling out through the mouth and inhaling in and exhaling out so once you have your breath dialed in beginning to draw some awareness to your physical body and noticing how you feel in this moment physically are you tired are you really energized is your body a bit nervous or anxious do you feel more sluggish do you feel blissful in your body there's no right or wrong the truth of the moment is what's going to guide you into that centeredness that freedom into what i call the diamond self so whatever you are truly feeling in this very moment whether you would consider it positive or negative. Open up to it completely and breathe into it. Wherever you feel that feeling in your body, breathe into it. And you may even notice that there is an emotion attached like fear or sadness or anger or joy and allowing that feeling to exist. Allowing whatever you're feeling in your physical body and your emotional body to exist. Staying with the breath. And whatever you're feeling in this moment, whatever the predominant feeling is, let's say there's something uncomfortable in your body The invitation here is to actually let it expand. So tracking from your toes all the way up to the top of your head, just really checking in with your body and how do I feel in my body? All the way from the feet up to the ankles, past the knees and the thighs and the hips, the reproductive organs, the solar plexus, the heart, the throat, the arms, the face, the top of the head, the inner brain, all the inner organs. And staying with your breath. And if any sort of bliss is present or discomfort, letting go of any and all control, just letting it expand. Find your let go. In other words, if there's anywhere that you're holding on, notice it 
and then find your let go, literally let go of resistance. And as you're finding this let go, this sensation of dropping control, I want you to imagine that out of your tailbone, there are these roots, like the roots of a tree. But imagine as you, like in the same way you would toss an anchor over a boat, and that anchor just naturally and effortlessly falls to the bottom of the ocean, allow these roots from your tailbone, as if you are a tree, to drop all the way down to the core of the earth with your own mind's eye, your own intention, your imagination. And imagine that these roots that are growing all the way from the tailbone, from your root, all the way down to the center of the earth, past gravel, past rock, past soil, past crystal, all the way to the core, core, core of the earth. Staying with your breath. And imagine that all the way at the center of the earth, all of the ancient trees, the wise ones, trees that are as, you know, 2,000 years old, all of their roots and their wisdom meets right at the center, exactly where your roots are dropping into. And all of these wise, loving, beautiful trees are welcoming you into this community or tribe of sorts, this wealth of wisdom, and linking up with your roots. So these trees that have been around for hundreds or even thousands of years, filled with wisdom, are now linking into your energy field, allowing you to tap into the deepest wealth of wisdom within you. Good. And as you inhale in, inhaling in this precious loving presence right at the core of the earth, and letting that reach all the way up to your tailbone, all the way up the spinal column, all the way up to the top of the head. So it's like you're being recharged with this beautiful, loving, kind, wise, ever available presence. And on your exhale, just allow anything that no longer serves you in your emotional, physical, mental bodies to actually fall away down that center column of your spine, through those roots, down to the center of the earth Asking permission from the earth, is this okay? Typically you'll get a beautiful yes and allowing that energy to just be transformed. It's like, just like dead leaves that fall from a tree, they metabolize into fresh soil. So as you let go of what is old and no longer serving you, knowing that the earth is utilizing it as fuel transforming old energy into new possibilities, into fresh life force. And as you deepen in that process of finding your let go, really letting go here, on your next exhale, feeling that your entire body is now refueling in all the spaces that have been freed up with this radiant loving essence, like this mothering, divine, inspiring essence, fueling you all the way from the soles of the tips of your toes to the soles of your feet to your ankles. I'm hearing church bells <laughs> as you're refueling. All the way past the thighs and the hips all the way up to the root chakra, allowing yourself to feel grounded and centered and clear and capable of being yourself in public surroundings and groups, allowing you to feel sufficiently held and loved by our beautiful earth, having all of your needs met. And as we move up to just a couple inches below the navel, really feeling this creative life force, your brilliance, the love in your heart, sensuality, creativity, circulating, fluid, clear, all of your one-on-one -on -one relationships being purified. 
And then as this energy moves up to the solar plexus, breathing in this light energy into your own relationship with yourself, your personal power, your confidence, your sense of self-esteem, being secure in yourself. And as you're breathing in, if you feel any remnants of anything that's blocking you, just remember you can let that go down these roots to the core of the earth. This process can happen simultaneously like the inhale and the outhale, exhale. And as we move up, just really purifying and empowering each line of energy or what we call chakras, each energy center and moving up to the heart. Really empowering forgiveness, empowering compassion, love, gratitude, deep, deep trust in your heart that you are well, all is well, and you are deeply loved and guided. You actually are love. A leader of love. And as you inhale up to the throat, clearing and cleansing and empowering your authentic voice, your music, if there's ever been anywhere that you have not spoken your truth or you've said things you regret, just allowing that to fall away with forgiveness and find your let go here, dropping it, it's in the past. And as you inhale in, allowing your full expression to organically grow and bloom from your throat so that there's a freedom in the way you express yourself. Your expression is beautiful. Your authentic truth, your voice, is a valuable gift. Beautiful. And as you inhale all the way up now to the third eye, the space between the eyebrows, just breathing in and cleansing out any limiting thoughts cleansing out the inner brain, relaxing the backs of the eyes, and allowing yourself to attune to the truth of who you are. Allowing yourself to see through the eyes of presence, of love, of source, and allowing your intuition to uh, blossom and awaken. letting go of all effort, just trusting that your whole body, your whole being is being upgraded to the purest, most radiant form possible. As you let go, life flows through you. As you ground into the earth as a tool, as a remembering that gravity does the work here and you can let go, there is something so much bigger than you holding you always then it's easier to allow that let go and to let life flow through you, allowing you to blossom and bloom and thrive, which automatically serves the world. Staying with your breath. And if your spine you notice wants to move or elongate or any part of your body is wanting to circle, just letting whatever's natural happen here and on this inhalation, inhaling all the way up to the crown and imagining that right at the top of the head there are these shutter, shutters, like shutters on a window, and allowing them to open as if there's a sunshine right overhead and letting that light, that golden loving light, that liquid light just pour in like it's pouring through the window, but pouring through this crown of your head like you're being crowned as the king or queen that you are of the present moment present moment is your throne, I like to say. Whenever you feel like you're disempowered, sit in the seat of presence and it's all good. And just letting that light pour in overhead like it's just showering through your entire body all the way down from the top of the head now, past the throat, past the heart, out the arms and fingertips, down through all the inner organs, the solar plexus, below the navel, 
the tailbone, the root, all the way out the legs, down to the core of the earth. And this beautiful light is now connecting with the loving energy of the earth. And you're feeling these qualities uh, above and below just moving through you, these loving energies, and they're meeting now in your heart. This grounded energy from below, loving energy, and this light illuminating energy from above meeting at the heart. And now imagine that they're merging and creating a spotlight from your heart. And literally creating a circle around you of light 360 degrees. Feeling yourself in this glow of light and anything that no longer serves you, just placing that outside of the light. And only that which is of the highest loving light vibration remains within that light. And just knowing that this light energy, if there's anything that you deal with during the day that you feel is negative, it's like anything that no longer serves you bounces off this light, returns to sender with consciousness attached. So you don't need to absorb other people's stuff. You can just be in this moment as the full, magnificent, whole, radiant you, deeply connected to your inner self, what I call the diamond self. And from here, breathing in, I don't know if you can hear these beautiful birds and such around, just really breathing in this moment Placing both hands on your heart and setting an intention for your day. For example, my intention is to embody the deepest level of presence available to me for my highest good and the highest good of all concerned with ease and grace. If you want to embody peace, it might be my intention is to embody peace today. It can be very simple with ease and grace. My intention is to love myself and be really kind to myself today. My intention is to see the light everywhere I go in all people and all things. My intention is to let go and trust into this loving force that is always holding, guiding, and protecting me. And lastly, if setting an intention is too complicated or pulls you into your mind, you can just think of a quality. One quality you'd like to embody more of. Love, radiant health, peace, freedom, authentic expression, prosperity, grace, freedom, wholeness, empowerment, self-confidence, whatever it is. Just imagine that quality in your heart and just trusting that throughout the day as you're inhaling and exhaling that seed is naturally blooming and you're growing into it more and more every single moment. Beautiful and when you feel ready opening your eyes. Thank you dearly for coming on this journey with me and this beautiful space in nature and may you have a beautiful, inspiring day or evening and know that you're deeply loved, you're deeply supported always. And um, remember the present moment is your throne. <laughs> Whenever you feel disempowered, just come back to the present moment and the easiest way to do that is be, come into your breath, come into your body, Come into the brow center if you want to close your eyes and just bring your awareness to this point. And that immediately brings you into your body and your body's here in the present moment. And whatever's here in the present moment awakens you out of the past and future and into the truth of who you are. So really simple technique. Um, I love you guys and have a beautiful day or evening. Mwah.